Brakata Yahawa, Brakata Yao Shai, 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 Baha Sham, Racha Ha Kwadash, Kahalayim La, Alahayanawa, Abanawa, Yahawa, Bahasham, Yahusha, Bahasham, Rakha Hakwadash, Sunya Kaba, Gawala Rakab, Hazukwanyam, Wahashaliakim Nawa, Shaw Yasharala, Shalawam, Wabarak, Labakarium, Shaw Yasharala, Shemai, Yasharala, Yahawa, Alahayanawa, Yahawa, Akhud, Shabab Shalawam, and speaking of Shabbat, the Lord has recently, the Lord our God has recently laid this man to rest. This man here, by the name of Evelyn Rothschild. Some people say Elon Rothschild, okay? But the Lord has recently <laughs> laid this man to rest. And it's. It's funny to me because it's it's on the Sabbath, you know. <laughs> hey, Lord, Lord, lay this dude to rest, man. You know, and I and when I saw this, I'm like, man, is this real? You know. Then I saw other articles. I'm like, oh shit. A <laughs> a hey, hey, uh, things about to speed up, man. You know, in the in the words of our apostles, beginning with the beloved Elder Apostle Tahar, shit about to move quick. Now I'm I'm repeating what he's saying. I'm I'm saying it too. Cause I can see it, you know, I, I believe it And not just by this, but this is more Ammunition, you could say You know It's more proof that, yeah, things are gonna speed up Things are speeding up, man I saw this, I was like, man, shit First I was like, man, what? <laughs> I was like, what the, what the fuck? I was like, you know, is this real? You know, then I saw the, uh, the beloved brother not the Zakia from the Chicago camp. I saw him going in on it. And not just about this guy, this this demon here, but also other topics. You know, the brother speaking about the blood moon and, and, and a lot of things just going on. It's a lot of things going on, man. But I saw this, I was like, man, what the, f you know? Like, man, what? But hey, you know, um, breaking news. Evelyn, or you could say Elon Rothschild is dead. Okay, he, he died at age 91. If this is true, I mean, you know, that he could fake his death if he, if he wants to, but I, I don't know. Maybe he didn't. Maybe the Lord actually took this guy out. Maybe the Lord took this guy out. We'll find out sooner or later. Either way, I'm sure that makes everybody else within that circle nervous as hell. Oh, shit. Because they, they, they know the Lord is real, so they're they like, oh, shit, the Lord killed him? We next? And they know once they go down, they're they're done. So now things are about to speed up, brothers and sisters. You know, we need we need to um take this ministry, this this truth more serious, take ourselves more serious. Okay. Being good brothers, you know, for the men, for you women being good sisters, you know. The time is at hand. Hey, hey the Lord took this guy out. I, I believe it. I mean, maybe it's not true. I, I mean, we'll find out. But um it's a lot of things going on because our God, Yahweh Shai, is the perfect, is, 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 is the perfect, is the grand chess player, man. And as our beloved Elder Apostle say, in particular, Elder Apostle Gabar, the beloved Elder Apostle Gabar, the beloved, excuse me, the beloved Elder Apostle Gabar, like he be saying, like he says, the Heavenly Father, Yahweh is the ultimate chess player in this life we see on the earth. It's basically him playing chess against himself. Now, our forefather, King David, he said in the Psalms, let me get it really quick. Let me get it. I'll just get it, you know. Quoting it won't do it uh, justice. You know, a lot of time we quote when we're, uh, we're not able to get the scriptures because we're doing particular things like, a, you know, walk and talk or, you know, we're driving, doing a video. But I have no excuse now. All right. So I'm going to get the scripture. Psalms chapter 17, verse 13. 
Arise, O Yahweh, by Hashem Yahweh Shai. Disappoint him. Cast him down. Deliver my soul from the wicked, which is thy sword. Right. Because everything these Edomites are doing, they're being re remote controlled by Yahweh, by Hashem Yahweh Shai. Edom is a damn robot. Edom ain't nothing but a damn human robot. They're cyborgs for the Lord. And we are too. But see, they're the left-hand side. They're his sinister side. They're the wicked. But he controls both sides. He controls the righteous and the wicked. You know? But just, you know, everything we see happening on the earth, the Lord is all behind it. All right? It's a lot of things going on. Things... Things turning up, man. Woo. <laughs> you know, hey, in the middle of this whole Kyrie Irving controversy, him and Kanye, him or Ye, excuse me, him, you know, in the middle of that, this happens too? Goddamn. Hey, hey, the Lord is, he's moving. The Lord moving, Jack. You better believe it. You know, and we need deliverance from these people, from these, these strange children, these Edomites. The Lord is going to make them come down with great wrath. So Psalm 17, 13, arise, O Yahweh, disappoint him, disappoint his plans, disappoint that NWO, make that shit not work, okay? Destroy it, destroy this beast system, cast him down, cast him down from his excellency, because right now these Edomites are in heaven, they're going to be brought low, deliver my soul from the wicked. Which is thy sword, the serpent, Cain, Esau, the wicked, the, the Edomites, deliver me from them, because the Lord gave them the power. From, from men which are thy hand, his left hand. Look up the word sinister. Look, let me, fuck, hey, fuck it, man, I'll look it up. The word uh, uh, sinister. Salat. Remember, you know, the scripture said from men, which are thy hand. OK. And now the app don't want to damn work. The app don't want to work all of a sudden. Come on now. <laughs> hey, it's all good. Hey, Salak, man, give me a second. It's all good. You know. Now the app don't want to work. You can't make this up. Okay, Lord willing, we in the game. Lord willing. All right. The word sinister. Would you help too, man? Um, you know, uh, when you do a video, you do a lesson, and when it's starting to mess up, you know, uh, pray. And a lot of time, hey, the Lord, he'll he'll straighten it out. You know. He'll straighten it out. No, Satan's still going to mess with us. Satan's going to mess with us, but you know it's a fight. You know, the Lord wants to fight, you know. Okay, here we go. This is the word sinister. All right, let's get the actual etymology. Now, archaic, the archaic meaning of sinister, archaic means ancient. You can't make this shit up. Sinister means on the left side. Left. Now remember, the scripture said from men which are thy hand. From men which are thy hand. Now we always say these Edomites are the Lord's left hand side. So his sinister side. Sinister means left or left side. Okay. Middle English, sinistre, unfavorable. Because the Lord didn't choose Esau. He chose Jacob. He doesn't show favor to Esau. You know, he, he just set them up as, as really a lesson for us, for our education, for us to learn wickedness, you know? And also to, to see what happens when the Lord judges the wicked. All right? But he didn't choose them. And also the Lord's fair. You know, he gave them. He gave him power for a while. 
No saves from old French, from Latin, sinister, on the left, unlucky. He saw definitely unlucky. He gonna see how unlucky he is. All right, very soon. Okay, now it says C15 from Latin Sinister on the left hand side. God damn it. All right, look at that. Look at that. Sinister means on the left hand side. It's showing hey, the spirit of the Lord dealing with our apostles, man. Hey, through the spirit of Yahweh Bashim Shai, they've been saying this for years, man. Through the spirit, they've been saying this for years. These Edomites are the Lord's left hand side. Sinister. And you're gonna hey in, in the time to come, in Jacob's trouble, we're gonna see how left hand, how much left hand energy these people are all about. Because they are the actual physical counterpart of Satan on the earth. Like the beloved apostle to Harvey saying, Esau is a demon in a body. E e Esau, Esau is a um, how do you say it? He's a demonic angel. You these Edomites, you Edomites are demonic angels on the earth. And it makes sense that that's how you have a uh an an actual explanation for all this wickedness that's going on around us. Cuz everything deals with energy, man. Energy is everything. Energy is everything, man. You know? People bring certain energy. People create the atmosphere in a place. If, if, if a particular group of people move to a certain area and other people stand up before them, you know, but, but those people move and another group of people move in after them, the atmosphere changes. That, that place changes. And that is the same place, but it's different people there. You know, because people are energies. They're, they're, they're spirits. Energy is everything, you know. You know what I'm saying? Even the clothes we wear, like everything, you know what I'm saying? I had a, I was making a joke the other day, you know, um, <laughs> I've been seeing a lot of Eve wearing blue jean jackets. I was like, man, Eve got a damn blue jean jacket demon on her. <laughs> you know, ain't nothing wrong with a woman wearing a blue jean jacket. I was I was joking. But everything is energy. Even, well, even dealing with the clothes we wear, that's why you shouldn't have mixed fabrics. Things should be pure, you know? Hey, hey, from the fabric to the food we eat to colors, energy is important, bro. Because energy energy comes from your how about Shemiah was shot. Energies have meanings, like, you know? But but these Edomites, they come in the energy of Satan on the earth, man. He who's coming is after the working of Satan. Sinister on the left-hand side. On the left-hand side of who? Who's left hand side? Who's left hand side? All right. Ecclesiastes in the Bible, chapter 10, verse 2. This was said by the preacher, which is King Solomon. Ecclesiastes chapter 10, verse 2. A wise man's heart or a wise man's mind, his spirit. A wise man's spirit is at his right hand. Whose right hand? Yahweh, the Heavenly Father's right hand. So, who was his right hand side? The righteous, or or, or uh, what would it say? The the wise. The the wise represents the righteous, the holy people, the Israelites. So we're the Lord's right hand side, but a fool's heart, a fool's mind, a fool's spirit. A wicked person, because a wicked person is not wise. A wicked person, spirit, is at his left hand, or, or at his left, his left hand side, his sinister side. All right. So, so these Edomites are Satan on the earth. They're the devil in the flesh. They're, they're the devil on the earth. And like our forefather King David said, from, from men, deliver me from men which are thy hand, his left hand. Okay? Because they want to fucking kill us. All right? And nothing has worked. Showing you, we got to be the people of the Lord. These Edomites have done everything in their power to destroy us. How else are we still here unless it's a spiritual explanation for it? All right? So, yeah, man. 
this place is fucking done, man. All right, and 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 I'm I, I want to celebrate. Like this is happening. Oh yeah, and it's the Sabbath, man. Turn up, man. Hey, hey, brother, should, <laughs> brother should be popping bottles right now. God damn it, you know, for real. You know what I'm saying? Like, and, and and more things are gonna happen. You know, we're ultimately we're waiting for that MOTB, the Karagma. But you better believe things about to speed up. Hey, for you brothers that drink, man, hey, shit, hey, hey, throw a couple back, you know? And which, which I don't drink, but hell, you can throw a couple back for me. You know what I'm saying? Hey, call halayim la yahal ba shimiyahu shah. Call halayim la yahal ba shimiyahu shah. Call halayim la ala hayinawa abinawa yahawa ba shimiyahu shah ba shimiyahu kakudash. That's right, man. That's right. Lord took that motherfucker out, man. I'm happy right now. I'm I'm ha I'm happy, okay? Lord killed this dude, man. Cause he's a part of an agenda that's all about destroying our people, man. And they hate the most high, man. And this dude is Amalek. Amalek has been a hot topic in the news. Goddamn devils. And the Lord took this motherfucker out, man. You fucking right, I'm happy. You fucking right. I don't even gotta read the articles. You know, I I'll, I'll read them on my own time. On my own time, I'll, you know. I, mean, I can read them in this video. But to me, the headlines just speak for itself. Look at the headlines. He died in 91. The Lord took this motherfucker out. You know? And I'm, I'm not taking my language back. I, I hate these dudes, man. I'm not retracting that. Now, if you don't like me saying so-called curse words, leave the channel, man. Please unlike, don't share, and unsubscribe, all right? If you, if you will subscribe, leave. Because I'm going to call this dude a motherfucker, all right? You fucking right, I'm happy he did, Okay? And he come back into slavery too. You fucking right. You fucking right, man. <laughs> Lord took this motherfucker. I'm happy. Hey man, Brakatha Yahweh, Brakatha Yahusha, Brakatha Yahweh, Brakatha Yahusha, Brakatha Yahweh, Brakatha Yahusha, Brakatha Yahweh, Brakatha Yahusha, Baha Shemra Kakwadash, man. You fucking right. Okay? Show that again. Show that again, man. <laughs> hey, our God don't play, man. Yahweh about Shimei Yahusha don't play, all right? He took that motherfucker out, man, all right? And we're going to get some more scripts. Because, see, you can have all the money you want, but when the, when the Lord demand your spirit, you gone. You disappear. The Lord can make you disappear. Just like that, nigga. And my phone chimed. You, you didn't hear it. But, uh, you know, it's an app on my phone. It had chimed right when I said that, you know? Hey, because, hey, the Lord controls life and death. You can have all that money you want. When Lord demand that spirit, you disappear just like that. You gone. You in the fourth dimension just like that. Ecclesiastes 8 and 8. There is no man or woman that have power over the spirit to retain the spirit. You can't keep yourself here. He keep you here. You can't even kill yourself unless he, he got to sanction that. And if the Lord wants you alive, you're going to stay here. If you want you gone, ain't shit you can do about it. My phone chimed again, but you didn't hear it. Neither have he power in the day of death. You gone. And there is no discharge in that war. Ain't no getting out of that. Neither shall wickedness deliver those that are given to it. And see, you look at this motherfucker. You look at this, this cocksucker, Elon Rothschild, Evelyn Rothschild. This dude did a lot of wickedness. And it didn't deliver him. All, all that goddamn adrenochrome, all, all uh, everything they do, man. You know, child sacrificing, eating pineal glands. That shit ain't fucking work, man. It didn't fucking work. Lord, kill your ass, nigga. Nigga art. Eat him. And, and, and the rest of you, Rob Childs, you better be fucking nervous. Because he going to get your ass next. And if he don't, if he don't kill you, you're going right into slavery. Bunch of damn crackers. He getting all you motherfuckers, man. All of you. I, I'm happy. All right. I, I, I'm, you know, I'm saying rude language, but I'm, I'm happy. Okay. I'm, I'm, I'm. This made my day. Like I said, I, you know, I don't drink, but hey, you brothers, man, if you don't even drink for me. Hey, drink. Hey, this prophecy. Throw a couple back, man. Hey, I don't drink, but I'm gonna eat though. I'm, I'm gonna eat me some. I might give me a, uh. What's what's gonna be the best uh, uh beef they got? Is it Wagyu? I don't know how you say that word. 
But 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 like that 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 prime choice meat, goddamn it! I'm I'm Lord, well, I'm gonna get it today. And you know it's Sabbath. Hey, we it's a the Lord laid this motherfucker to rest. I'm happy, bro. And more things gonna happen, brothers. Hey, Amen. Woo! Now Edom is unfavorable. They're the left hand. We pray the Lord have favor on us, man. Hey, we, hey, Jacob needs favor, man. You know, and we hope to be a part of the Lord's chosen, within the chosen. Lord willing, we are part of the elect, man. And and we really going to celebrate, man. But but this is good. The Lord ain't going to show favor to you Edomites, but he's going to show favor to us, man. And that's our hope. Let me get a scripture on that. Lord took that motherfucker out. You know? <laughs> yeah. Lord took his ass out. All right. Now we pray the Lord have mercy on us though, man. Cause our guy terrible. He 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 don't play. Okay. We, we we need mercy, man. But he took that motherfucker out, and I'm happy about that. We should be happy about that. Okay. All right. Uh, give me a second, man. <sighs> Woo. He gonna have mercy on Jacob at the end of the day, and um. These are beautiful psalms, brothers. These, these are beautiful. I'm, I'm, I'm going to read Psalms 105, not the whole chapter. I'm, I'm going to read down, though. Psalms chapter 105, verse 1. Oh, give thanks unto Yahweh, by Shem Yahweh Shai. Call upon his name. Make known his deeds among the people. Sing unto him. Sing psalms unto him. Talk ye of all his wondrous works. Glory ye in his holy name. Let the heart of them rejoice that seek Yahweh. Seek Yahweh, by Shem Yahweh Shai, and his strength. Seek his face evermore. Remember his marvelous works that he have done. His wonders and, and the judgments of his mouth. O ye seed of Abraham, his servant. Ye children or, or sons, ye sons of Jacob, his chosen. He is Yahweh our power. His judgments are in all the earth. He have remembered his covenant forever. He have remembered his covenant forever. The word which he commanded to a thousand generations, which covenant he made with Abraham and his oath unto Isaac and confirmed the same unto Jacob for a law and to Israel for an everlasting covenant. Yes, indeed, baby. So we're going to go from there to 106. Psalm chapter 106, verse 1. Praise ye Yahweh. Hallelujah, Yahweh. Bashem Yahweh Shah. Oh, give thanks unto Yahweh. For he is good, for his mercy endureth forever. Who can utter the mighty acts of Yahweh? Who can show forth all his praise? Blessed are they that keep judgment, and he that doeth righteousness at all times. Remember me, O Yahweh, with the favor that thou bearest unto thy people. O visit me with thy salvation. Them chariots, that chariot, that fathership, that fathership. Okay, with the favor that thou bearest unto thy people, his people, the Israelites, man, beginning with the elect. But he's gonna show favor to Jacob, but but Esau, he ain't gonna show favor, man. Esau was not a favorite, Esau was not his favorite, Jacob was his favorite. All praise to you, how about Shema was shy, man? Okay, and we want to be in the kingdom soon that I may see the good of thy chosen. You want to see good happen to Israel. We already see the curses. Like, man, shit, you tired of seeing this shit. That I may rejoice in the gladness of thy nation. That I may glory with thine inheritance. Man, yeah, yeah. And now, now we on the bottom because we did this. We have sinned with our fathers. We have committed iniquity. We have done wickedly. That's why we threw, but we ain't going to be through much longer, man. Shit. Hey, hey Esau about to get paid back. All right? They about to get paid back, man. Call her like like you how about Shemel Shai, man. They threw. You eat them ice through. It's too late to apologize. Fuck that. No, you going right into slavery, man. I don't want no damn apology. And don't want no money. And then we gotta work for these people, but reparations ain't gonna repair shit. Hey, you, you going right into slavery. You going right in them fields just like we was working on them fields. Okay? That's what's gonna happen. You, you hey the big payback. Dun 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 revenge. Payback. Uh, like, <laughs> got to get back. <laughs> da, da, da. Hey, you Edomites gonna pay, boy. Woo! Yes, indeed. Psalms chapter 22, verse 29. All they that be fat upon earth shall eat and worship. At the end of the day, we all serve you, how Bashim Yahweh Shai. The right hand or the left hand. The right hand and the left hand. You Edomites serve your purpose. 
And at the end of the day, at the end of the day, eventually, which is very soon, we're going to be in the kingdom of heaven and you're going to worship Yahweh by Shemia Shai. You know, because, hey, if the Lord was on the earth today, you would call you would call our Lord a nigga, man, because of how he looked. But but guess what? Hey, you're going to fucking pay, man. And you're going to be forced to worship Yahweh by Shemia Shai. We don't give a damn. You're going to worship our God, man. We worship the damn cracker, that, that, that white Jesus. And Jake, Jake wearing fucking Caesar pieces. Call them Jesus pieces, and which is idolatry. A nigga getting ready to celebrate Christmas, which 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 is all wickedness, man. Which they go back, it go back to Babylon. Ultimately, it go back to uh to Egypt and, and Rome, Saturnalia, you know. And once again, Babylon, Nimrod, Semiramis, and Tammuz. Wickedness. It's wickedness, man. You know? And, and Christ's mass, which means. The Messiah's death. You ain't celebrating his birth. You celebrate his death. In Christ's mass or, 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 or uh, Xmas, you know, bullshit, man. You celebrating the Messiah being Xed out, crossed out, and it shows America got to be Babylon the Great. Cause what it say, Revelation eleven to eight. Their dead bodies, talking about Israelites in a dead state of mind, shall lie in the street of the great city, great city of America, Babylon the Great, which spiritually is called Sodom in Egypt. We know why America called Sodom. All right, you know, you got gay marriage, you know, uh, they got the rights to get married, you know, same sex couples, you know, uh, um, changing their sex, LGBT, QP, whatever. You know what I'm saying? All that BS going on, that's why America saw them. And it's Egypt because Egypt is the house of bondage. America, the house of bondage. All right, just like ancient Egypt. Israelites was in slavery in ancient Egypt, same thing today. Modern day Egypt being America. All right, all the pyramids and, you know, obelisk. All this Egyptian symbolism and everybody got bald heads. A nigga want a bald head. Jake love bald heads. It go back to Egypt. You being buried six feet deep, masonry, you know, um, um, just all this wickedness, man. A lot of it go back to Egypt. Even, even Jake, uh, uh, drinking beer, drinking beer go back to Egypt. Like it just, I mean, you know, but it says, uh, with spiritual cow, Sodom and Egypt, talking about America, where also our Lord was crucified. They crucified the image of our Lord in America. Our Lord didn't literally die. He did not literally die in America. Okay? But they X'd out his image. They crossed out everything that he stands for. They, they, and they crossed out his, his actual image because our Lord looked like this. This how he looked. He don't look like no goddamn cracker. He looked like a so-called black man with white woolly hair. A white afro and a white beard, dark skin, dark brown skin, and, and red eyes, man. Because he was known for drinking wine when he was on the earth. Uh, uh, this, the scripture in Genesis spoken of our Lord. His eyes shall be red with wine. And his teeth white with milk. Is describing a so-called Negro. Okay? Talking about our Lord. He don't like no cracker, man. He don't like no Edomite. All right? He don't look like y'all. And he not, and he's not like you. He, he, he doesn't behave like you. Y'all the wicked. And, and Christ's mass. You, you celebrating his death. It's no, it's no coincidence. Y'all celebrate that bullshit in December. Because, you know, in the wintertime, everything dies. You celebrating death. You eat my fucking through. Y'all the wicked. You're going to be destroyed. America going to be destroyed. You're going right into fucking slavery, man. And I believe all the words spoken of by the holy apostles and prophets. You know, the men of the Lord. You know, the men of Great Millstone. Beginning with our apostles, man. I believe it. The, the Lord, he giving us all the proof. He dealing with these men. Psalms 22 and 29. All, the, all day they be fed upon earth. Fat many, they, they live in abundance. They live in luxury. And Lord smoked his ass. Lord took this dude out. You know? So, yeah, you eating for a little bit. But but he see, the beauty and, and the thing about you, how about Shemel Shai, all things obey his will. Even the wicked. They really doing what they supposed to do. Okay? They serve their purpose. You know? Now, they're not, they're not worshiping our Lord how we worship our Lord, but they serving their purpose. Cause you, hey, worship that they, they goes in a, you know serving, you know paying homage, but they doing what they were created to do. All day they go down to the dust shall bow before him. So Elon Rothschild, this cracker, this fucking cracker, this motherfucker right here, all right, this dude right here. Hold on, man, give me a second. Let it pop up. Show his fucking face, man. Yeah, man, hey, this, this fucking app, man. Give me a second. It's slow. 
this motherfucker right here is worshiping Yahweh Bashem Yahushua right now. If this news is true, if this is true, this motherfucker right here, this Edomite right here, is worshiping Yahweh Bashem Yahushua right now. And in in Elon Rothschild, Evelyn Rothschild, he realizes that he's not important. He's a fucking nobody. And he coming right back in chains. God damn it. God damn it. All right. I believe it. I believe it. You know? And hey, and the rest of you, Ralph Childs and other Lee Banker families, you all through. Just do what you gotta do, man. Okay? You done. You're fucking done, man. All right? Doesn't matter what you do. It's over, man. It's over. <laughs> It's over. Psalm 22 and 29. All day, all day they be fat upon earth shall eat and worship. All day they go down to the dust shall bow before him. Elin or Evelyn Rothschild is bowing to Yahweh Shah, man. That fucking cracker. And none can keep his uh, and none can keep alive his own soul. Doesn't matter how much adrenochrome you drink. Doesn't matter how, how, how much you into uh, popping little boys. In their anus. It doesn't matter how much energy harvesting motherfucker that the Lord require your spirit, you gone. Bitch. Alright? Bitch. You gone. Just like that. Just like that. He gone. He out of here. Alright? You fucking right, man. You fucking right. Hey, hey, hey man. <laughs> you know. Brakatha Yahweh, Brakatha Yahusha, Brakatha Yahweh, Brakatha Yahusha, Brakatha Yahweh, Brakatha Yahusha, Brakatha Yahweh, Brakatha Yahusha, Baha Shem Rakhak with Dash. And this is about to happen soon. We know what they about to do, okay? I'm happy, but we know the seriousness of it. They about to come, brothers, okay? So be ready. I hate to quote these people in the church, but it's a true saying. Stay ready so you don't got to get ready, man, because they're coming. Revelation chapter 12, verse 12. Therefore rejoice ye heavens. And ye to dwell in them. So we, we happy, we celebrating, but know what time we in, man. They coming. Woe, meaning destruction to the inhabitants of the earth and of the sea. And they got an exclamation point. So this, this take it serious. For the devil, which is Esau, Edom, is come down unto you, having great wrath. They pissed off. They desperate. They tacky. They sloppy. They threw. Okay, that they're finished. Because he know of that he have but a short time. Right here. I mean, come on. They know they got but a short time. They out of here, man. They out of here. It's over. It's fucking over, man. Okay? Not to mention this whole con uh, controversy. This whole controversy with Kyrie Irving. It's a video. Play it real quick, man. On the tube. The prophecy tube. Because YouTube was made for the prophets. It was made for the word of Yahweh Bashim Yahushua, which is conveyed by the prophets. Now, now we know that uh, recently, Kyrie Irving did what he did. He made that post. He made that tweet about that, that uh, book and documentary, Hebrews to Negroes. Okay? And he received a lot of backlash behind that. You know? Um, but I got to say, they attempted to buck break him, but, but, but he's not broken. I mean... I'm not sure if he's sincere or, or not, but man, the way it's appearing, it looks like he's serious. Like he, he's sincere. Kyrie Irving. You know what I'm saying? So this thing, hey, Brakatha Yahweh, Brakatha Yahusha, Brakatha Yahweh, Brakatha Yahusha, man. Hey, they, they didn't break him. They attempted to, but hey, Kyrie Irving, hey, he, uh, he's standing strong. You know what I'm saying? But anyway, they wanted, they wanted him to apologize. And, and 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 he gave an apology without saying he apologized. It wasn't good enough. They want him to owe half half a million, you know, give, give half a million to these different charities that that uh that are against anti-Semitism. Okay, so they they wanted to uh, break him spiritually and mentally, emotionally. They didn't want to break his pockets, take his money. They wanted to you know be a bully and take his money. Okay. And, and and then they suspended him for a little while. Is it like what six games or some shit? You know, it's so it's so many games he can't participate in. 
But see, on top of that, they want him to just completely bow to Baal. They want him to just completely bow down, basically to them, to, to Satan. Because y'all y'all Satan, man. Fucking Amalek. You the chief house of Satan. You the goddamn devil, man. You, you, want him to, you want this man to bow? Basically worship you. You know, be re-educated. You know, by all these different rabbis. And it, it's, it's not enough. Nothing's ever enough. So you can never please these motherfuckers, man. You can never please these motherfuckers. Man, fuck Amalek. But see, what we see is prophecy. The Lord, the Lord swore that uh he would have war with Amalek from generation to generation, brothers. That's what that's what's happening. The Bible's real, man. It's real. The Bible is real. Okay? And ev eventually, Amalek gonna be wiped the fuck out, too. After that thousand year period of slavery, they're gonna serve. Nonetheless, let me play this video. So the topic is Kyrie Irving. A lot of hot sh man, turn it up. Turn up. Man, turn up. Alright? <laughs> A lot of things happening, you know? This dude just he, he kicked the bucket. He gave up the spirit. Elon Rothschild, Evelyn Rothschild, and Kyrie Irving recently made a statement. Now they suspended him. You know, they doing this, they doing that, right? Doing this and doing that, but this is what this man said recently. This put up by Aboriginal power. And it's a lot of Israelites that know that they Israelites now. It's a lot of Israelites that know that they Israelites. So this truth is blown up, brothers. Brothers, you know, it's blown up, brothers and sisters. So let me play this video. And what's going on around here that y'all paint. Let me uh, sharpen the image. Oh, you can't make it up. The quality for this current video is 144. Wow. And, and, and that's the only option for the picture they'll give you. Normally they'll give you like 360, 720, uh, th uh, 360 P, 720p, you know, etc. But it's only 144. We going home, man. I I don't care. I I believe I believe we going home. I hope we going home, but I believe we going home though. All right, so I'm, I'm gonna play this, man. You know, I don't care. Hey, 144 is great picture quality to me. So um, breaking news. Kyrie Irving sent chilling message to the NBA and Vlad TV. Put up today. Man, the Lord coming back, man. The Lord is coming back, brothers. All right. And attention because without us making a change right now and and shifting our consciousness, our kids are they're, they're going to fall victim to this system too. And the system I'm talking about is it's a myriad of objective topics that we follow since we were kids, which is... You know what's heavy, too? Because a lot of time, 144, it'll, it, it will appear like it's not the best quality, but this is crystal quality. At first, you notice it, it, it didn't look so sharp. Now it's sharp on 144. It's kind of like, I pray we don't men, but it's kind of like us. Like, we don't look so... <laughs> we don't look so good, right? We don't look so sharp, but then... I hope we, I mean, I, I pray with the elect, man, you know, but I'm, I'm going to play this again. Okay. God damn. I'm going to just play this man to close it out, bro. And then give me some chicken or something, you know, that bird, you know, man, brothers is, um, you know, it is, is dying, is dying. Old ways of living, the old ways of doing things. It's not it's not going to last for too much long. I'm saying this to y'all specifically because it's important that those that understand that are aligned and what's going on around here that y'all paying attention because without us making a change right now and and shifting our consciousness, our kids are they're, they're going to fall victim to this system too. And the system I'm talking about is it's a myriad of objective topics that we follow since we were kids which is sex love relationships religion culture class finance entertainment basically esau edom has destroyed everything that's why we called him the devil that's why the bible calls him the devil the word devil means deceiver 
And when I say Esau, when I say Edom, I'm talking about the so-called white man, the so-called white race, the so-called white man and woman, beginning with the elite, who control the society. They basically essentially control our reality. These Edomites control reality. They're the God of this world. And they're going to be cast the fuck down. When scripts speak about the wicked or, uh, or the devil falling to the earth, it's talking about these Edomites losing their they power, man. Their, their power that the Lord gave them. The Lord gave them that power. He's going to take it away. All right? He's going to cast them down. Lucifer falling from heaven is so-called white man losing his power, man. And everybody is waking up now. The Lord is removing that veil. The Lord is removing that veil. He's, he's, he's pulling back the veil. The book of Revelation. The book of Revelation means to pull back the veil. Revelation means reveal pull back the veil re meaning back veil veil pull back the veil apocalypse 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 pull back the veil revelation all right the apocalypse the pull back the, the veil the revealing the revealing of the truth the truth all right yahweh shah man and everything yahweh shah is doing okay and lord pissed off man he tired of you devils. All right. Entertainment, media, you know, social platforms at this point. Please do not fall victim to these things that are being manipulated and controlled. Please do not. Please do not. We have so many truth tellers out here that are doing the right things. Um, you know, and I could point them out, but you have to have your own level of discernment once you're uh consciously awakened to what's really going on and i could go on and on but look i have to speak in general topics because it gets too mixy you know what i'm saying but i hopped on here specifically to share something with y'all my generation the millennial generation we got to be better we got to be better my millennial generation we got to be better we know too much of the truth and sometimes that will put us in places where we're fearful or we have anxiety and in order to make an impact out here that is generationally sound, where it lasts for not just one generation, but for seven to 10 to 20 generations now, we have to break free mentally, spiritually, emotionally, physically. You know what I'm saying? It's not easy to do it, but we have people out here that are willing to extend a helping hand and, and do it, you know? And I went live on this main page. And, and he ain't saying nothing wrong, you know? He ain't saying nothing wrong. I won't be surprised if you're watching us. I mean, I, I, I don't know. You know what I'm saying, but you'll be surprised who watching the Israelites, man. Like, actually, the, the, the camps, the One West camps, you know? Man. Which, you know what I'm saying, ain't about us, but um, it's about the truth. The truth which the Lord gave us, and the truth is you have a shot, man. You know? I pray this is edifying, man. Hey, we going home, brothers. Pop a bottle, goddammit. Hey, but but you know, stay in the spirit. We gotta stay prayed up, keep our faith up, man. We going home. Keep our shit wired tight, as the beloved El Apostle Rakaya Allah be saying, it's over. This is just breaking news, it's all over the place. They did they didn't bug break them. Now I made a video uh uh entitled the bug breaking the Kyrie Irving, and you know. Um but basically it's more so an attempt of what they wanted to do and, and you know i'll go back and change the title i'll change the title man you know because it didn't work look at him he, he hey he's standing strong bro and how much more should we stand strong those of us that, that are prophesying those of us that are prophets you know i pray this edifying man i'm gonna change the title man because they ain't bug break him you know he's standing strong you know what i'm saying how what bracket they was shy hey and, and we need to stand strong and it's gonna speak about a hey, second address uh Two, those that stood so stiffly for the name of Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shai. Okay, so if he's standing strong, how much how much shall we stand strong, right? Those of us, especially, that have the names Yahweh why Yahweh Shai, man. All right. Okay, so, uh, but that's it. Barakatayahweh, Barakatayahweh Shai, by Hashem Rakhakudash, Shalom.